This the opener. It's live next on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you. And part of the story here is the Albite Stadium by night. 60,000 capacity here. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's England against the United States. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. And so the match is underway. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. John Stone starts alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Must be! Well, as you can see, they don't come much better than this. It's a goal of the highest quality. Wonderful piece of skill. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Pulisic. Here's Aaron Long. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Mount. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. And just over the bar. Really good effort. Robinson now options are plenty oh that's a really good run oh tremendous goal a long way out but took it on a memorable finish well here it is again and wow just take a look at this he's absolutely nailed this one what a strike that is from distance Away following the equalizer. States, number 10, Christian Pulisic. Well read to win possession back. Kane. Well, the supporters think it's on. And they're trying to get right into his face. Robinson Pulisic now plenty of support here terrific piece of anticipation Shaw Sterling counter-attacking very much an option Foden, just cutting off the supply. Kane, and it might appeal to Raheem Sterling, you know. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. An incisive pass, 
Well, he had just gone beyond the last defender, Stuart. Well, that's a real shame because the through ball is really well weighted, but he just took too long to play it. Top class defending. Brendan Aronson. Ferreira. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Oh, can you believe what we've just seen? I think we're going to be viewing that goal time and time again. Well, just look at this. Magnificent agility, perfect timing and great connection. What a goal that is. to a close Christian Pulisic well underway once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half Pulisic delivered into the box Well, what a piece of skill this is. It had everything. Agility, technique and power. It's a great goal. Goal! No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Sterling. Mount. Shaw. Sterling has it. Kane. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Pulisic. Well, unfortunately, he couldn't keep the shot down. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Oh, great piece of individual skill. Kane. Oh, big opportunity. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Timothy Weyer. Weston McKinney. Pulisic now. Way up, and that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Phillips. Foden. Now with Mount. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Now well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. England recovering possession well. Calvin Phillips. Could be. Closing down well. the easiest of saves but you'd expect him to stop it and there's the delivery oh super header but the goalkeeper was up to the task oh good save excellent header having won the ball back they might be able to profit and still an opportunity and they produce the arrears you never know they still believe in themselves 
Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. You can't really say defences are on top. 3-2. Adams, way up, could play it in, McKenney, not the pass he had in mind, and full time, we can say it officially now, the United States have won, and Stewart, I wonder what you've made of their performance. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end. But it was a fantastic showing from Christian Pulisic. Stuart, keen to get your assessment. What caught your eye in particular? Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly.